we've got the standard hood. We talked about it being optimized for the Packard engine, which is in both length and weight, so it's six inches shorter. We also have an optional hood that's available for the, the Cummins engines as well. And I also mentioned the five-piece hood construction. So if you look at the hoods behind me here, you've got five pieces, but the key is that the fenders are bolt-on for easily replacement and repairs. And so we can replace if either side of the fender is damaged, we can replace in under an hour and a half and, and get the, the truck back on the road. Also take time to get in the trucks, mention the panoramic view uh, with the wider cab, right, in terms of more interior space, better visibility, so get in and, and look at it. Also mention the, the all metal crown and grill with that signature Kenworth look. So take time, look at them. Um, look at the Packard engine under the hood. And then to my left, your right, is the 680 52-inch sleeper. And I mentioned we've got the, it was, the mid-roof was optimized for tanker and flatbed applications. We've also got the aero fairing that's shown on the, the one to my right here that for also for those that have the uh, van bodies. And so with that, the, the sleeper 52-inch I mentioned with the Packard uh, standard hood with the Packard engine being six inches shorter, you combine that with the 52-inch sleeper. Overall, that's a 30-inch shorter wheelbase, again, for regional haul applications. And I mentioned the sleeper difference is about 700 pounds. When you combine that with the Packard engine and standard hood, it gets us close to 800 to 1,000 pound weight savings uh, over our standard 680 with the 76 inch sleeper. So also get inside, the interior has been optimized for the drivers that spend three to five days on the road. And then I'll direct you to your left. I'll give you a chance to take pictures and then I'll direct you to your left. Behind you is our Advantage truck, and again, Gary mentioned we've got the truck here with the short trailer. We've also got a tractor trailer that shows the optimized configuration out with our tour trailer. And again, we've got elements that are powertrain related. We've got aerodynamic improvements. I showed up in the room the aero improvements both from a, a tractor as well as the trailer. 